Hi everyone, I'm Geffen, I'm a BI consultant here at SciSense, and my tip for today is how to use the autocomplete. So when I want to add a new custom SQL expression, all I need to do to get started is to select my table with the scroller button of my mouse. That will insert a full SQL statement with the select and the from. Then, if I want to keep editing it, all I need to do is click on the control space. This will give me the list of the tables, some operators, some SQL aggregation, and functions. I can also add an alias. This alias can allow me to select specific fields within this table. And if I want to see this list again, I need to just click on the control space. This can be very helpful when wanting to add new columns into existing tables by, let's say, lookup. I can go here, click on the lookup, and I have here all the placeholders that this function is expecting to receive. The control space will allow me to see suggestion of what I can add to this placeholder. So this is a remote table placeholder, so now I can see all my table lists. Now, if I'm clicking on the comma, I'm going to the remote result column. Now if I hit on the control space, I will see the, t the list of fields that I have in this table. And so on and so forth. It just makes everything a bit more easier and quicker. So I really recommend it. Hope this was helpful. Have a good day. Bye.